my name's Angela, aka Smart Mom with two A's, which stands for Strong Mothers Altering Autism's Reality Together. A few years ago, I created a symbol called the Autism Welcome Decal Symbol. I was inspired by my own son, who will be 21 years old this year. Now, his mentality is more of a three to five year old, so needless to say, it is very difficult trying to take him into public places. So, I came up with something that I thought would be helpful to me and others like me walking in my shoes. So, needless to say, I was uh, very frustrated the first few years, like most companies, places, which by the way, I'm not a company, I am just a symbol. Uh, I was very fl flustered when I first started this. I was really hoping it would take off, but I, I don't think I got across uh, why I created it and what the purpose of this decal was and I don't think that came to light until this year because this year has been just absolutely wonderful with all of the places that have been reaching out to me and responding to me as well. And that's what leads me to today's uh, little tidbit I wanted to share with you. And before I've mentioned to you, uh, I, I believe everything happens for a reason and I am a true believer of how fate can be a marvelous thing and in this case it certainly was. So. Um, I decided I was going to uh, reach out to Toys R Us. I uh, go there frequently with my son. I have been going there for years now because I use it for reinforcement for his behaviors, uh, going to the dentist, uh, and other things. And uh, it works real well as far as giving him an incentive to do well. But um, I, after I decided, uh, well, I, I, I pondered for a little bit because I really didn't think I would get a response like I did um, from Toys R Us, so I decided I was going to reach out to them one day when I walked in there and actually it was just uh, last week so I reached out to them and I had asked uh, well I had just talked to him a little bit about the decal I gave him in my little letter that I invite uh, to places that I I would love to see the decal live permanently and uh, of course uh, I wasn't getting a response uh, and immediately and I, I understand that because I know we're dealing with corporations so I was patient I'm, I'm a very patient person so uh, Anyway, I decided randomly to take Dustin into Toys R Us a week later, and um, it was primarily because he had done very well at therapy that day, and I just felt he'd earned it. So as I'm driving down the highway, because it takes me a little bit to get there, um, I, didn't, I didn't answer my phone. I had a call, and I didn't answer my phone, and like most of us, we are very smart not answering the phone. We're driving down the road. So... Um, I didn't answer it. I got to Toys R Us. Uh, I decided I'm just going to run in there real quick so it looked like the weather was coming in. I'll go grab his toy and we'll just leave and I'll check my message when I get back to the truck. Sorry if I'm rambling on, but there's a point to my story. So anyway, I decided to go into the store. Uh, we grabbed our little toy that, John, that Dustin decided to get and uh, I was stopped by Michael. Michael, by the way, is the person I talked to a week ago. He is the manager, or one of the managers there at Toys R Us in Sanford, uh, Florida. So um, he had stopped me and uh, said, Angela, and I just kind of was taken back because it's been a week. I honestly, I was surprised he remembered me. I'm sure they got a lot of people that come through there. But um, I looked over, I said, yes. He said, uh, weren't you the one that uh, called out on me with a decal because um, I had called and left a message did you get my message and I had said uh, no I'm afraid I didn't and what was it about well that's what I'm calling uh, that's what I'm sharing with you guys today um, this is the message that I received from Michael hey Angela this is Michael at Toys R Us Stanford um, I'm calling because we actually got approval to put that decal up in the window um, so, yeah, if you want to give me a call back. And isn't that the most awesome phone call a person can get? I know I certainly was thrilled. So, uh, I just wanted to share that with you. I have already put together the uh, Autism Welcome Decal smile photo for Toys R Us over there in Sanford, Florida. Now, keep in mind, this is only at that store. They are not affiliated to my decal. They are simply giving the decal a home, encouraging families like us to come into their place and just to let them know that even though they're not sensory friendly, they are welcoming friendly and they are there for you. They totally understand and um, your, your autism is just welcome there. And we already knew that, but isn't it nice to know that that decal is going to be there at the entranceway, not today, not tomorrow, but every day to welcome us 
with that wonderful smile as soon as you enter that door. Now, I'm hoping that the rest of these places, such as Toys R Us, are going to jump on board now that I've got one. Um, but uh, I'm a patient person, like I said. Um, it takes time, and I'm, I'm willing to wait. But in the meantime, I just really wanted to share this with you. Um, it's really made my day, and I just wanted to send out a big, big thank you uh, to Toys R Us in Sanford. Um, I also want to thank Michael for being so kind to talk to me and um, to reach out to, um, to Diana, who is also the manager there at Toys R Us, who they, I don't know what I would do without the both of them reaching out to corporate to actually make this possible. You guys are just absolutely wonderful and thank you, thank you. So in the meantime, like I said, autism welcome, opening doors, opening hearts and creating smiles and I hope I made you smile today so now it's your turn to make me smile once more reach out to me I'd love to send you a decal to give it a permanent home so that you can send me that wonderful smile of yours and I know you have one so in the meantime take care big big hugs and see you soon bye bye